keep your little learner busy learning. Here is a very fun leprechaun math game. In the description is a sample of this game. Download it and play. So to play the first level, you need just one dice. And I have put this in a page protector because you're going to want to play this again and again. You'll see these circles down here. These are for numbers. You can put any number one through six in these circles. Why one through six? Because we're using dice and those are the only numbers we have. So randomly, and I'm just gonna leave this blank down here for now, but when playing, they would fill that in as well. So let's have red go first. Red rolls the dice and gets a three. Can use any three they want, but this three is right there. So I am going to use that three. Blue's turn, blue gets three as well. Crosses out this three. Play continues until someone, let's mark up this two. Let's say that red now rolled a five. That means they've completed all the circles down here. They circle their leprechaun treat. They have just captured mm -hmm, mm, this leprechaun cupcake. The player with the most circled treats is the winner. Simple. To play the second level, we're going to jump up the skill level a little bit and do some addition. The circles down here will be numbers two through 12 because we're using two dice. Just for sake of getting this done quickly, I am going to do this, 11, 12, two. It can be random though, right? Let's have red go first. Six plus six is 12, X out. And they can say the numbers, the number sentence and the sum to their partners. Six plus three is nine. Play continues just like the previous way until all the numbers are done. Now let's say that red got a one and a one and a two. So they X that out circle it. The player who has the most treats at the end of the game, just like the first version, is the winner. This is perfect for five, six, and seven-year-olds. I hope you like it. Give me a thumbs up if you do, and I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.